Welcome to Technical Drawing. Today we will see this sum. They have given us front view and top view. We need to draw isometric view. So now if you see right side 100, height 50 and left uh, width 50. So 100 will go on right side of O, 50 on left and height will be 50. We will draw layout first. After drawing layout, if you see front view, there are two parts, part 1 and 2. Out of this, part 1 is nearer to you, part 2 is in between. So we'll start with part 1. Now if you see part 1, they have given 30. So I will mark 30. See this 30, then 30 down and here 20. So this way we are done with part 1 except that slot. Now the box is ready. Now what we should do, whatever is there in the front, the same thing is behind. How much behind? 50. So I can take all the points behind by 50, 50, 50. So this is 50, this is also 50, so we are done with part 1. Now we need to draw that slot, so that slot we need to draw it outside. So what we will do, first I will draw horizontal line, I will mark 30 and I will take height. 10 and I will draw 45 45 degree as shown in the figure. So I'll take 45 from here and I will take 45 from here. I'll take height 10. So what I will do, I will mark 20, 30, I will mark O and from O I will go up by 10, this is M and I will draw parallel line. This is distance X. So what I will do, I will take M to that distance x encompass and I will cut from m on left as well as on the right side because both the sides we have distance x so what I'm doing I'm transferring x x on both the side so this way you will get the slot part and this line is going inside because this is dotted it's through and through so we are done with part 1 now we need to draw part 2 if you see part 2 it is how much behind 20 behind so I will mark 20 and then I'll mark 10 so from here you draw a line slope and you draw a parallel line like this then again we'll draw one more line at a distance of 10 and again we'll draw one more parallel line again we'll draw one more parallel line so we are done with that part 2 also now we need to draw circle semicircle if you see so we have a length 50 we'll take midpoint and we'll draw a line now how much is this 15 15 see we have a radius 15 so diameter would be 30 so we need to draw rhombus 
30 so what we will do from center point we'll take 15 15 15 15 and we'll draw a parallel line so this way we got rhombus now we need longest diagonal so we'll join longest diagonal this is point 1 this is M M join 1 to M 1 to M this is 2 this is 3 and 4 so what we will do we will take 1 to M and we will draw R then we'll take 3 to M and we'll draw R so we'll be done with the half circle now same half circle is down also at 50 so from here we'll go down by 50 50 this will be dark this will be dark and this will be straight so from this point one you go down take height 50 you project that height 50 down one dash from 3 also you go down by 50 you mark that point as 3 dash now you take 1 to M you take that radius and you keep a compass at 1 dash and you draw an R so when you do that you will get this lower part if you check 3 to M but that is hidden that we can't see so I'm not drawing that so we are done with isometric of the sum I hope you people have understood this. Thank you.